understanding that we have and sell an, uh, an inverter driven Hertz changing compressor, mm -hmm. all right? So if you think about that just for a second. So the rated capacity that you see is the same thing that you've seen from legacy manufacturers, right? This three ton system makes this much heating and cooling, okay? So that's rated capacity, and that's what we've been using to design and apply for manual J's and things like that through the years, all right? Having a Hertz changing compressor allows us also to see what is the minimum capacity. In other words, how slow or how, how, how low can the Hertz go on this compressor to meet capacity? And then the maximum is just the polar opposite of that. How fast can this compressor spin and how much heat or cooling can it make when it's spinning at those speeds. Listen, I just explained to you the entire magic, if that's yeah. what you want to call it, with what inverter-driven Hertz-changing compressors 